Hey, what's up guys? It's Candice and welcome back to my channel. Today, I just realized when I woke up that I completely forgot to do a monthly favorites video for the month of August. So it's a little late, but better late than never. So we're gonna jump right into my favorite products of August. But before we do that, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and go ahead and hit that bell icon so that you're always notified of every future upload. So guys, on to the favorites from the month of August. All right guys, I really don't have a whole lot, but this is a good mix of hair products as well as beauty, as well as lifestyle. So we're gonna start off with hair care. Now, I told you all that I'm on this natural hair journey for the second time around, and now we are nine months in. And I've really been struggling this time around to find products that work with my hair because this time around, my texture is a little bit different, my curl pattern is a little bit different. So it's been a little bit of a struggle trying to find hairstyles that are wearable for everyday uh, work and play, as well as products that give me the right amount of moisture as well as flexibility to do different styles. Um, being able to manipulate the hair has been a little bit of a struggle. However, I have watched countless videos, I've read numerous blogs, I have reached out to so many different people to ask for recommendations on hair care products, and one that was given to me was Diva Curl. So these are the products, and uh, let me see here, I'll just kind of hold one up at a time. So this is the Diva Curl product, and Diva brand is very well known in the curly hair community. They, all the products are 100% sulfate, paraben, and silicone free, so they are great for your hair. And this is the uh, Decadence line, so this is the Deeper Curl No Poo Decadence, so it's a zero lather, ultra moisturizing milk condition, um, cleanser. So I apply this to my hair when it's soaking wet and I really concentrate on the scalp and making sure I'm cleansing my scalp and then I'll work my way to the roots of my hair. This is a no lather shampoo so you're not going to get any type of lather or anything like that. So if you're expecting that or you want that, you're not going to get from this but it is very moisturizing. It is a moisturizing cleanser and it works wonders. You really don't even need to go in with a detangler because this helps to detangle your hair too. However, I am definitely saying you still need to condition, but usually when you condition is when you start feeling that your hair has been detangled, but I notice it when I'm using this no poo cleanser. After I follow up with this, um, or after I use that, I follow up with the One Condition Decadence Ultra Moisturizing Milk Conditioner. And here's what this looks like. This is a miracle worker, you guys. I, it's almost empty and I've only been using this for about two weeks. You can use this as a normal conditioner and wash it out after you've shampooed or you can use it as a leave-in as well. I've used it as for both and it is amazing. And I've had read mixed reviews where some people can't use it as a leave-in conditioner, which is perfectly fine. But for my hair texture, I can do that and I really like using it um, for both. It really just depends on if I'm needing a little bit more, more moisture. But this is a great detangler. I'm able to uh, finger detangle when I use it. So sometimes I'll alternate between my Denman brush and finger detangling and I'm able to do, do both when I use this. And these products, this Diva Curl products, they really brought back my ability to do a true wash and go. With other products over the last nine months, I've not been able to do that. My hair is just really limp. It looks drying almost, and the detangling process has been very difficult until I discovered Diva Curl. So I'm able to do a wash and go, I'm able to have a little bit more flexibility with my styles, and this is an absolute keeper for me. Now, I will tell you that I did purchase these off of Amazon, and these two products, along with three others, came in a starter kit. And I want to say it was like 39, 40 bucks. Um, but of course, all of these products I will leave a link for in the description box below. And in the kit, you also got like a a deep conditioning, like a mask, and some type of serum or something. I haven't really used the other products yet, but these two for sure, I'm gonna have to reorder. And I'm obviously I'm gonna try to find um, where I can just order them individually and not in the starter kit. So, on to the next. All right, in keeping with hair, 
Um, one of the things that I've really been trying to be very mindful and consistent with is doing a deep conditioning treatment every week, if not every week, as if time doesn't allow, at least every other week. And having to sit underneath a hooded dryer is a bit of a hassle. It's time consuming having to get it out, set it up, sit underneath there. And when you're sitting underneath of a hooded dryer, you're limited. You're, you have no flexibility as far as your mobility. You are stuck wherever that dryer is. And so you're, you're less productive. So I've really been looking for something <clears throat> that can help with the deep conditioning process as far as providing heat. And I discovered um, the Thermal Hair Care Hot Head Heat Caps. And this is what this looks like. And it's got some kind of seeds or something inside of here. And I will link all the details below. It's some kind of seed, like maybe soy seed, soybean seed, something of that nature inside uh flaxseed maybe something y'all i'm probably messing it all up anyways whatever's inside of here it works because what you do is so this is the outside of it the pattern side and they have tons of different patterns for you to choose from um so you put this in the microwave like this okay and you put it on um high heat for 45 seconds then you take it out you flip it inside out you put it in there for another 45 seconds and then you do the same thing again. You flip it out, right side out, and you always want the elastic band side to be up. You put it in the microwave for another 45 seconds and you guys, this thing gets hot. It's not too hot to touch, but it's definitely um, making sure that it's, it's retaining heat on the inside. And then you, after you've put your deep conditioning treatment on your hair, you put like a clear plastic cap over top of your head. And then this goes over top of the plastic cap. And you all, it will stay warm for about 45 minutes to an hour, at least mine did. Um, and then you can always take, if you want to wear, wear it for longer, you can always take it off, put, pop it back in the microwave again. But you all, this allows you the flexibility to walk around your house, do some cleaning, do some work, do whatever it is that you want to do. Eat, whatever it is that you want to do so that you're not just stuck underneath the hooded dryer. So, thermal hair care, kudos to you all, big thumbs up. This has been an absolute lifesaver and has really upped my um, deep conditioning hair game. Definitely recommend this. Again, I will leave a link for you guys to where you can check their site out below. And I believe this retails, I've seen it on various sites. It's on Amazon, it's on their um, particular website on thermalhaircare.com, it's also on Etsy. I've seen it retail anywhere between 20 to 29 dollars. <laughs> you like how I say dollars? <laughs> uh, 20 to 29 dollars and um, you know, feel free to check it out wherever you see fit, but I will be linking Thermal Hair Care's website below. Okay, the next monthly favorite from August, I did mention a few videos ago, and that was the Tatcha Silk Canvas Primer. And I did mention that this was a bougie AF product. Um, it's expensive, I believe it's $52. It is very expensive for a facial primer, but you guys, it does work. Um, it's not necessary by any means, but it does work. It smells amazing. It has that like rich skincare type smell. It comes with this little like disc scoop where you can just kind of scoop out the product, rub it on your face and then you rub it in. It absolutely does work. This is probably one of the best primers that I have used in a long, long time. And I know a lot of people are allergic to silicone. This does not have silicone in it. And I know that, you know, people really like the silicone feel when they use primer because they feel like it really smooths out your skin. This does the same thing, but without the feel of silicone. So I definitely would recommend trying this out. This is definitely a splurge, but it does, um, it, it does really work. And again, this is from the brand Tatcha. This is called the Silk Canvas Filter Finish Protective Primer. So you put this underneath of your foundation. Next product that I'm really loving is the Stila Aqua Glow Serum Foundation. Here's what the packaging looks like, the exterior box, and then here is what the actual foundation looks like. Now, I have not actually demoed this on camera for you guys, but I have been testing this out and wearing this for the last couple of weeks, 
and you all I'm kind of loving it now this is not a new foundation by any means I think it's actually been out for a couple of years and on most beauty sites even Stila site you can find this on sale right now so if you're looking to try a new foundation and you don't want to spend a lot of money you don't want to pay full retail this is absolutely one that I would recommend you try out because most of them are on discount and they're on sale right now but I really, really, really like this foundation. It gives you that luminous type of glow from within look. It lasts all day long and it doesn't even feel like you have anything on your skin. Now I will tell you this, the color I have now, it matches my tan. So it doesn't match my face, but it matches the rest of my body. So it's great for me to wear um, in the summer months and right now as we are transi transitioning into fall. But that is also one of the downsides is that they do not have a large shade selection at all. I do believe there were only two sh dark shades and I think they were deep and dark. Yeah, so here's deep um, and then this one was dark. So these are the only two darker shades that they had. Well, what in the world? Okay, yeah. So these were the only two darker shades that they had that would even remotely fit my skin tone. So the shade selection is absolutely terrible, but the dark does fit my tan color. So for that reason, again, this is only a, a foundation that I would be able to use in the summer months because of this lack of shade selection. And this does run a little deep and a little red. So definitely need to have a tan for it. It does not, not match my normal skin complexion. But guys, other than that, I really, really like it. I really, really like the actual um, packaging of it. It's like a dropper. Well, I didn't do that right. <laughs> so it's a little dropper. You, you um, twist it up, a little thing comes up, you pull it out, and then you press the button and the foundation is released. Really awesome. I really like this. A lot of foundation and highlighters are going to this type of component. So I think it's really nice. Now on to the next. Um, the next product is actually a mascara. I have been looking for so many um, different eyeliner and mascara options here lately because I just feel like the ones that I've been using have grown a little stale and I don't love them as much. I feel like they don't work as great as they once did. So a new eyeliner that I discovered is the High Caliber Lash Mascara from Stila. And I think I said eyeliner, but I meant mascara from um, Sigma. <laughs> Gosh, Sigma Stila, I'm getting it all confused. The High Caliber Lash Mascara from Sigma. And this is what this looks like. And I did not put any on today because I wanted to do it actually on camera. So I really like the way that this goes on. I think it applies really easily and it coats every last lash, you guys. And as you can tell, it gives me immediate lengthening. lengthening and it makes them really thick and full. I mean, you can clearly see a difference between this eye and the other that has nothing on it. It is absolutely amazing, and it is a very reasonable price. It is not gonna break the bank like some of the new um, high-end mascaras that have come out here lately. So I definitely would recommend trying this out if you're looking for an affordable mascara that performs extremely well. It does the trick. It gives you fullness. It gives you length and it doesn't break the bank. Um, would definitely, let me look at these lashes, you guys. I mean, this is definitely a top performing mascara for me. I don't so that is that. Um, as of always, all of the products are listed down in the description box for you to check out. And the last thing that I want to comment on this is kind of totally random, but one of my girlfriends, actually my neighbor, um, we were having a one night a couple weeks ago and she just recently redid her living room and in her living room she's got this console table and on the console table there's a basket and inside the basket I noticed that there were all these little mini books and they all had like the same name but like different dates and volumes on the spine of the book so I'm like oh that's really neat so you know it's nice it was neat it looked really cool I'm like what is this and as I'm taking them out I noticed that they are photo albums and she was telling me, oh my God, girl, have you never heard of chat books? And I'm like, no, tell me. 
So, Chatbooks is an app that you can download on your phone and it syncs to a number of things. I think it can sync to like your Instagram page, maybe Facebook, some other social media outlets, and it can also just uh, sync to the camera roll on your phone. And so what it does is, as you save pictures to your phone, every night or every couple days it will do like a syncing and an upload to the Chatbooks app and it will start building a photo book based on your pictures of whichever outlet you designated to take pictures from. And each of the books, you can put up to 60 pictures in each book, and as your pictures fill up, you, you can, if you don't wanna to touch it at all, you don't have to. You just let it filter from whatever you want. Um, but if you wanna take time to actually review the pictures, edit them, things like that, you can. So every night, I have gotten in the habit where I go into the app and I look at the pictures that have, have synced up to the app, and then I edit them. I can make them larger, I can zoom in, zoom out, I can add captions to the pictures, I can switch out which, which pictures I want on the cover page, etc. You could do all kinds of things. But if you don't want to touch it, that's totally fine. Once your book fills up with 60 photos, what it'll do is you'll get an email notification saying, hey, you have a chat book that's getting ready to publish. If you want to make any type of edits or changes, you've got three days to do it. So at that point, you can log into your app and make any type of changes to your book that you want within three days. Then the books automatically ship to you. The best part, you guys, these books are only $10. So every single month, essentially, you're going to get a new photo book. And so I started it and I wanted, I did the subscription service where it automatically does it every month. It's $10 a book, but I also did um, a quick catch up because I had a, a lot of pictures on my phone that I wanted to hurry up and make albums for. So my first shipment, I actually got two books and this is what they look like. The quality is really nice, you guys. I mean, the pictures look great. Yes, that's my family. <laughs> um, the pictures are great. I mean, you've got everything in here. I mean, the pictures look awesome. You can make a full size. I mean, they really, you all kind of, I mean, I'm, I'm, I was actually blown away, you guys, with the quality of these pictures. I mean, it's just... I mean, look at this. And this right here is my girlfriend, Keisha. Um, she's the one that actually told me about it. Um, so, I mean, this is just really nice. So guys, I definitely recommend that you all order uh, chat books, download the app, and you can like name your books. So um, I did the subscription. So ours is called The Halls & Co. And then they send them to you by the dates. So each month you'll have a new book with dates and so you can set them out for coffee table books or however you want to display your photo books. But I thought this is a really neat idea. Great way to, you know, create keepsakes and memories to share for a lifetime. I know that sounded like a freaking Hallmark card. But anyways, you guys, I will have a link below to where if you want to try chat books, you can get a discount off of your first shipment if you use the code below so just let me know and or if you have any questions about any of the products i've talked about today feel free to leave a comment below or you can send me a message and i'll be happy to answer um, again i do apologize that this favorites video was a little late but better late than never all right guys that is it for my monthly favorites from the month of august don't forget to give this video a thumbs up hit that subscribe button and go ahead and hit that bell icon so that you're always notified of every feature upload all right guys hope you guys are having a great weekend bye